you can open the roof you can open the doors all of the parts of the Jeep you can open it but even though when you drive the car there is no such sound that coming in of the air so this is very nice thing Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum people I'm Karkid you're watching a car review this is called the Jeep Gladiator Rubicon launch edition Jeep has introduced this Gladiator in 2018 from 2018 it went on production in 2019 actually and from that time till the present it's in production from 1986 to 1992 there was a Jeep Comanche and it was in production I'll post the picture and you can see that one after that this is the only pickup truck that Jeep offers you there are different trim levels in this one sports level then sports plus then the overland then Mojave that's for offering and this is the Rubicon launch edition there are only 4190 units of the launch edition that will be produced by the Jeep it's paying the number 4190 it's paying homage to the code area that is 419 it's in Toledo uh, Ohio it's uh, the, the there is a Toledo complex in US so it's paying the tribute to that area with this number so I have borrowed the car from bulk motors here big car collectors in a video you can jump in their showroom take my name and if you want something you can get a reasonable discount so the starting price of the Jeep Gladiator base version it's $33,545 and the launch edition it can jump up to $62,310 in UAE you can get it $180,000 approximately and it can jump up to $265,000 dirhams so talking about the engine uh, the engine inside this Jeep how you open it there's a latch on both sides open them and like that you can open the engine of this Jeep and it's installed with the 3.6 liters Pentastar V6 petrol engine producing 285 horsepower at 6400 rpm 353 newton meters of torque at 4800 rpm 0 to 100 in 8.7 seconds 6 speed manual or 8 speed automatic transmission there is another engine jeep is offering that is 3.0 liters v6 eco diesel so if you are a diesel engine lover you can take the diesel engine so here's the front look of the gladiator with the nice new hood and these are the heat extractors actually they are open uh, from here but closed from inside this is not fair that side one and in the front you have a grill it's a little big and you have a trail cam what it does that when you're off-roading and there are some obstacles you can't see that you have option in the screen infotainment screen and you can click the button and it will give you the front view and you can see the obstacles in your off-roading and there's a little hole under the camera here this is actually a washer so in off-roading there's a dirt the camera is dirty you have option inside the screen clean cam when you press on the clean cam the water comes out and it washes the camera this is a nice thing and got LED lights here steel bumper here usually in the base version I think there is a plastic version also you have option for the winch bumper here you can add a winch in the center here you got some hooks and you got open front bumper so this is the side look of the Jeep Gladiator all Jeeps will be having the same V6 engine have a big fenders for the Gladiator and you can see the door hinges here you can open every part of this Jeep the body parts I'm talking about the body parts because every Jeep will be the convertible every Jeep will be with the bed and every Jeep will be the 4x4 four-wheel four drive so this is the tools what you require to open all the things this tool you can get it in in the Jeep it's provided by the Jeep these are only the tools that you require to open all these things so what you're gonna do is you can open all the doors and also you can open the roof how you can open it this is a hard top so hard top basically you can open only the front uh, easily by unlocking the hooks at the top there are eight locks you can unlock them and you can just pull the roof up but this section of the roof you need the, those tools to open that so how you open the front one that the locks just unlock it and eight total locks here so you have to 
unlock and it's very easy to remove this roof so this is how you can open the roof of a Jeep and if you are going for off-roading you want to enjoy the weather you can open the doors you can open everything with the help of those tools and it's so simple to fix these uh, roof pieces so they are so light and like this you can lock them again so, so this is the back look of the gladiator and you have the soft opening tailgate it opens very smoothly and you have a cover for your bed so usually every gladiator has a cover it's given from the company as well and this cover is special why is it so because it has a different positions for folding it doesn't have like it's not a one piece that you have to lift it up or push it up to uh, watch your stuff and take it out so it have different positions and it get locked with the tailgate itself so from here you have to unlock it with this latch and you have to fold it or roll over for different size items what you're gonna put in your bed so like this you can roll the cover and also you got some lights and you got port over that side for the 12 volts so when you also you have a reverse camera here it gives you very good HD quality view in the screen you have a bumper here with some hooks and some lights here at the side you got here the raw grill which I showed you from the side look so this is the interior of the Jeep have a look to the interior edition this is the dashboard of the car you can see and the infotainment screen the gauge cluster with the leather here when you start the car have a look the graphics with the old Jeep and it shows you this graphic it's amazing and some of the amazing thing is you have a gauge cluster this is the instrumental cluster you have the old analog needles here for the rpm and the speedometer and also you have a screen in the center that you can scroll on with these buttons to uh, for the different settings here and also uh, for different views when you drive the car it will show you map here and different options so this is very nice thing and the other thing which i like is the infotainment screen it's very very clean like no extra buttons here very clean and with the with all the options here and also the camera options which i showed you you can see in the screen so when you reverse the car or uh, you're going off-roading you can select the camera options these are the different views this is for the rear view camera this is for the trail camera and also you can clean the camera like that so you got these options in the infotainment screen as well down here you got some buttons for the air condition and also you have a diff lock manual uh, button here for your diff lock settings one interesting thing is you can't see the windows button here on the doors because you have to remove the doors so all the window buttons are here in the center so have a look when I press it so you can operate your windows from the center also you got some ports here this is the grab handle for passenger some air vents some space here at the front and very nice visibility these are the locks which you can open uh, for your roof removal this is the nice steering wheel here the gear shifters and interesting thing is you can see a gladiator picture in your gear lever this is the four wheel drive and very nice handbrake with the red stitching on it this is the armrest you got some storage space here so some other options in the infotainment screen is you can adjust some settings off-road pages so every car has a page that like a race page and in this gladiator you have off-road pages so when you click on off-road pages this is what it show you on the screen so you can see all the details here see the accessory gauge pitch and roll trail cam and every detail you can see on this off-road page and one other thing is you can scroll uh, to the right you have this forward facing camera when you click on it will show you the camera and select tire fill alert also you can uh, select the tire pressure for your car so when it get low or when it gets higher then the selected pressure 
the car, the car will honk. So these are the back seats. You can see some storage behind the front seat, some air vents, and also you can fold the seats like this, pull them up. You have a storage space under the seats. And one interesting thing is, you have a box. When you open your doors, you have to keep the bolts and everything, the Allen keys safe here in this box. So it's mentioned here where you have to keep the bolts of door, the hood and ETC. So some storage space under the seats and also one amazing thing when you fold this seat from upside down, this is a place for the Bluetooth speaker. Unfortunately, it's missing now, but you have a wireless Bluetooth speaker. You can uh, remove it and you can take it with you outside. You can connect your phone and you can play music. This is the window that you can slide it. So one interesting thing is when you open the roof, because you can remove all the parts for uh, the Jeep. So when you open the roof, these lights should be with the roof, but Jeep has installed these lights in the pillar. So when the roof is gone, the lights are still there on your pillar. So this is an amazing technology. So let's go for a drive. So finally the Jeep Gladiator 2021 Rubicon launch edition and uh, amazing interior, amazing driving position, amazing steering wheel, very nice steering wheel and uh, it feels very nice when you look at the instrumental cluster and it's all covered with the leather and with the red uh, stitching on it. The infotainment screen is very clean with no extra button, it's very clean, you feel so good when you drive the jeep gladiator actually i have driven the old one the jeep uh, cherokee and uh, the old one and the new it's totally totally different as this is the uh, newer shape of uh, the comanche you can say that uh, it's not an official statement but you can say that if you want to compare it because almost after 28 years they have launched the pickup truck in the jeep and you got three in one like you got a convertible you got a pickup truck and you got off-roading vehicle so this is something really nice and there's no sound actually it's a very nice thing that when you drive the car you can open the roof you can open the doors all of the parts of the jeep you can open it but even though when you drive the car there is no such sound that coming in of the air so this is very nice thing and uh, let's try it it's not that fast but this is for off-roading this is an off-roading car you got off-roading options you got fox suspension you got setting for the diff lock here separately and you got the four wheel this is something very nice man this is uh, a comfortable ride with the three-in-one option when you're driving the car you see the old technology and the new technology mixed because the gauges they are like uh, analog gauges at the side for the rpm and for the kilometers but in the center you got a screen that's showing you all the details and uh, you can see the map you can change into different views and also settings and also when you're off-roading the trail cam uh, it's uh, mounted in the front and you can see in your infotainment screen and uh, you can click to view the obstacles in front of you when you're off-roading in difficult situations so jeep has done like amazing job with the, this new gladiator and it looked like a gladiator so this was the jeep gladiator 2021 hope you enjoyed the video by mistake if i have given you any wrong information my apologies for that do take care of yourself and my channel as well till the next video peace out